Um, hi. Hi. Is Monica around? I, I have to ask her something. Doing her laundry. What's that? Came in the mail today. It's, uh, 72 long-stemmed red roses, one for each day that I've known and loved Emily, cut up into mulch. <laughs> That's awful. Uh, it's not so bad. Monica's gonna make potpourri. <laughs> I think I'm gonna go wander out in the rain for a while. But it, it's not raining. I can't catch a break. <laughs> you know what, Ross? You're not going anywhere. You're gonna sit right here. I'm gonna make you a cup of tea, and we're gonna talk this whole thing out, all right? Okay. Hey, Dave. Yeah? Um, listen, I'm gonna need to take a rain check. My roommate is just really sick. Okay? Okay, bye. <laughs> Honey, listen. I know, God, I know things seem so bad right now and that they're not Rach? gonna get it. Could I talk to you just for a minute? I, I dropped some socks. What is the matter with you? Do, do you want to fall into the trap? Do you want to fall into the trap? You did not drop any socks. <laughs> I just ran into Dave and he told me you blew him off. I mean, you listen to me. Now I'm calling the shots. I said you leave Ross alone and go get Dave. I mean, what the hell are you trying to do? Well, ultimately I was trying, you know, I, I wanted to tell him, you know, that I'm still in love with him. <gasps> and I say, no. Well, you know what? No, you don't make my decisions because you're fired. <gasps> you can't fire me. I make your decisions and I say, I'm not fired. Ha! <laughs> well. <gasps> oh. Rachel, come on, let me in. Having some trouble? Rachel, lock the door. I'll kick that door in if you give me a little sugar. 